Right, so we're back at Santa Pod Raceway. Morning, YouTube people. It's eight o'clock on a Sunday morning and it's GTI festival time. And just pulling up is one of the cars. I want to film. That's a thousand horsepower RS3 powered caddy. So hopefully we might be jumping in that. If not, we'll film it and just tell you all about it. But yeah, as soon as we can get the pass, we'll be in. We get round to the, um, the pits and just film whoever turns up eh, and see what goes on. But stay tuned, it should be a good one. You cleaning already, mate, are you? <laughs> How you doing? You running or just show and shine today? Show and shine. Today. Yeah. You're not going to give it a go, no? Nah, no point. What? Snap my drive shops. Does it have it? What, what power are you running then? Just under 400. Yeah. It's on air though. And it snapped the drive shaft? No, no, it would. Oh. I don't trust it. Really? Yeah, I don't trust it. See, it looks <laughs> business, but is it? But is it worth it just for that? For me, it is. <laughs> That's because you're a tart. <laughs> <laughs> You have a good day though, mate, yeah? Right, here we go, the gates are open. This is only a smaller show, the GTI Festival, so it's all round the other side. All the show and shine entrance part round the other side. All the racing cars around there, They're all up in the pits at the far end. I'm not sure we're general public park, but we won't worry about that. We'll get set up and just film everyone coming in. Right, let's see what horrible faces are on the gate. Hey. Hey. Oh, good morning, young man. How the devil are you? Morning. I thought well, I won't bring the van. I'll bring the golf today. You've done me like a keeper then. <laughs> Here, I can stop. Who are you? Yeah, you can How are you doing, though? Yeah, I'm good. Yourself? Yeah, cold, but all right. No, it's lovely. Let's go set up. Let's do some racing. I'll catch up. You're on the other side. Right, yeah. well, there you go. Have a good day, man. So I've managed to park myself up in the show and shine area, right on the end we are. But just behind me is the entrance to the start line so I can just run back from the track to the car uh, to grab me uh, other camera equipment or have a drink, whatever. But this whole car park behind me, it should all fill up with the people doing their show and shine and the racing um, cars, anyone who's doing racing, will be right down the far end. What we do, we give the car a very quick clean because it's a bit Shiny, anyway. Yeah, a foam, oh, oh, yeah, I've got one. I'll, I'll fill it out anyway. Yeah, no, well. you definitely will. Yeah, yeah, because you know, you never know. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> tough. That means I've got to give it a clean now. That's <laughs> no, all poncy not stuff. Not necessarily. <laughs> Let's not be silly. No. Right, that's the car as clean as I can get it. The sun is shining straight on it. Uh, I've got a black car, but that's it. We're only parked up so we can be. Uh, close to the uh, drag strip here but we're on the end of show and shine we're going to have a walk around and we just see which cars are here i wish i bought a white car now <laughs> so easy to clean aren't they? they get dirty but they're easy to clean aren't they? yeah i mean i don't go for the power i've always been a, a scene queen as they yeah. go <laughs> <laughs> but no it looks really smart though doesn't it yeah it's not bad and you've got your rocket forms on there what about the brakes are you going to up upgrade them uh, or it's getting the racing line stage three kit on the front. stage three are you and then That's... the the new racing line rears when they come out. Oh yeah, because I can't find them because I've gone race. All mine's racing line tuned. Yeah, yeah. This is all racing line. Uh, we're for a company called Catmans. Okay. There, we're racing line authorized dealer. Okay. And we get everything put onto this car for that. So it's got. So I need brakes. to hit you up for my brakes, do I? Yeah. For my stage two yeah. brakes. I'm only going stage two. Yeah. Who are you? So you're Chapman's, yeah. Yeah. And you specialise in just Volkswagen's and Volkswagen, Volkswagen, yeah. Yeah. Well, and where actually located? Uh, St Albans. St Albans. All right, man. Around the now. Okay, man. I'll hit you up and see what you uh, yeah, what lovely. you can supply me. Nice one. You have a good day, though, man. Thanks, sir. Morning. How you doing? You did okay. Hey, how you doing, brother? Right. Car's looking good. Any changes since I last saw you? No, same. Same, yeah. It's good enough, yeah. It's a cool looking car mate. Thank you mate. We've done engine wise to it. Uh, racing on intake. Yeah. Full, you know, the full thing. Oh, okay. Uh, not much. Okay. Um, race line intake, all the racing line bits of bombs yeah, underneath. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Miltech sports cap, obviously Miltech cap mag as well. Uh, in the cooler standard at the moment? Yeah, standard cooler. Stage 2, 250 brake. Yeah, nice man. So literally, all I need, I think all I need for a bit more is a uh, bigger in cooler. Yeah. Golf turbo. Yeah. And you're away. And we'll be uh, on the way to more. So. Nice man. But, Have yeah. a good day, yeah? Thank you mate, cheers. You... Getting around you are, aren't you? I'm always around you. I know you are. <laughs> Normally in trouble somewhere. <laughs>
You have a good day though, yeah? Yeah, cheers mate, you too. Yeah, I bet. Jesus, look at that. Just like they don't come out in the rain, does it? It has been out in the rain. Yeah? Then you frantically get it cleaned when it uh, gets home. So what's the set up on that then? It's an ABF. Yeah. Bike carbs. Yeah. Off a uh, bandit 12. Yeah. So what does that give it? Low down or top end? It gives it <laughs> full. <laughs> One, it's plenty of petrol. <laughs> <laughs> plenty of petrol. If and it guzzles like a it. bitch. And it sounds nice, yeah? It sounds throaty. <laughs> we don't really give it a lot. You don't need to, do you? The slower you go, the better you look, yeah? That's it, true, yeah. Something down that line. Something down that line. Good luck today, yeah? Have a Thank good one. Thank you. Cheers. Oh, cool looking van. It's your one, mate. It's a nice setup, isn't it? I only came to the for a look. Just see what's going on. How would you find the air ride on it? Yeah, yeah. Bloody expensive, but it's lovely. Isn't it? Is it? No, quite, no problems you've with got it? Have it? No, it's only been on there since January, so it's quite new. Yeah, early, mine's, mine's lowered on coilovers. I do like it, but, but just because it's practical, really. Yeah, and it looks the bollocks. <laughs> it does, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah. What's the setup in the back then? You got a dogs or something? Oh, it's for the dogs, yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's um, yeah, yeah, it's all for the dogs in the back. Look at that, man. Yeah. That's cool. What dogs you got? Uh, collies. Yeah? The collies, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's cool. So it's a bit of a camper, yeah. day van type arrangement. So you don't take the family out, just the dogs. Just the dogs. They won't take that. Yeah. <laughs> Have a good day, mate. Cheers, mate. Hello, mate. Yeah, mate. Are you all right? Yeah. What's done to this one then? Apart from being clean? Uh, clean. Obviously, the maximum parts on it. Yeah. Wheels, uh, eight piece suspension on it. Daddy, look at that! Yeah. about 3.30 brake stage one at the moment. Awesome. With, who did you get to do that? Uh, total Vag in Leighton Buzzards. Oh, okay. Yeah. They've got, I think they've got a thing up Good setup. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, good lads down there. Anyway, you have a good day, pal. Yeah, yes, mate, you too, Take mate. it easy. That's a muddle. Well, what we do, we take a walk up the far end of Centre Pod. They'll have some uh, club stands up here and also some of the races will be parked up. So we get this done now, because it's a long old walk up here, and then we'll walk back down through the other cars in the shower and shine, and go and line ourselves up on the track for a day's racing. And I've not even had a cup of coffee yet, what's going on? Hello mate. How you doing? Not too bad, yourself? We haven't had our usual photo of me and you going like that. Right, so these are the club stands up this end. Yeah, mm. spent 10 minutes on that one. Which one? The green one, the green one. So what's so good about it? <laughs> it's different in here. Let's have a look there. Go on. <laughs> How's it different to the green one next to it? It's <laughs> a very slightly different shade of green. <laughs> so who's the quickest? Uh, of course, me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> nice <course>. one. <laughs> have a good day, yeah? See you later. It's the quickest one to put his foot on brakes. Yeah. <laughs> That sounds nice. That sounds good, doesn't it? <laughs> Alright, I've got to hop through it down here because the uh, there's our VW DRC heads up race today, which is going to run throughout the day. So I imagine they're going to be first down so that the track's nice and clean for them. There you go, made it. Let's have a look, see who we got in the lineup. We'll be on a 16 car ladder potentially, maybe drop to an eight if we don't have uh, eight or more vehicles going on by the time you come around. To show your wristband, if you're going to miss quite on round number one qualification. Full send or just checking the track out? Uh, we're going low pressure launch, yeah. so uh, just over wastegate launch, but still full power in third four. Okay, good luck. We'll see what happens. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, have a good one. You ready, yeah? 
We all switched up or just a test at the start with? First test. Yeah. Nice and easy. And what's your record again at the moment? Uh, 9.044. You have a good one. Yeah. That's it, are you? Oh, it's on and good to go. Good morning, ladies. What's your best good again? Right. You've run in low 10s before, yeah. haven't you? Years Recently, ago. Recently, yeah, 10.3, 10.4. Last time I saw you guys and girls. See if Three we can improve on that a bit. Any changes since last time? Yeah, we're trying to reach the power ups. It was just only running so just over half power. Yeah. Yeah. Just controlling it, what's the problem? Just getting the power down, yeah? Yeah. yeah. All right, well, good luck, stay safe. Right. 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 Take it easy.
second round of the VW DRC heads up coming any second. Run what your brung's still on going. We're still down by the side of the track. We're going to uh, grab something to eat in a minute and get ready to film this next lot of cars. <laughs> Coffee time. I've been on the track all morning. It's time for me to go and grab a coffee. I'm going to walk right down into the, uh, the VW DRC pits and have a look at some of their cars down there. I've not walked all that way today. So let's just go and put one camera down and have a walk up the far end of the pits. Alright, this is a super cool caddy, this one. Nice set of Bentley wheels on it. Couple of really cool TTs here. I love these little lightweight seats. And this one here. They are smart cars. Never been in a TT. Mark III VR6. That is nice. And again, a set of Sparko racing seats. I'm not sure whether they're 3 litre V6s. I can't remember what these are running. It's got a V6 number plate, so it's got to be in it. Whether it's a 2.9 or a 3 litre, I don't know. Cool. Carrado sitting there. One of these yours, mate. Hmm. That one is, mate. Yeah. <laughs> you don't see many about the old G60s, no, you do you? Mate. You don't. All standard. Nah. What's done? <laughs> What's that? What's done to it? It's all forged. Um, big valve head. Bigger valves. Cam. Cam are down. Little yeah, Hampton, bigger, mate. bigger supercharger. Yeah. He's alright down now, like I've been down to see him. Oh yeah, yeah. it's a nice boat job. Yeah, yeah. So just keep an eye out, I've got a couple of shows, videos backlogged, but yeah. I'll be doing this one as well. Oh yeah, yeah. And we get your car in it. Yeah, awesome. <laughs> Have a good day, mate. See you later, Now this guy here, he wins a lot with this car. I don't know if it'll pick it up, but look at the paintwork on it. That's a full-on install, isn't it? You, you can't compete with people like this. That's a cool set of wheels. Yeah, they're nice. Is this your one here? Yeah. That's a cool set of wheels, isn't it? <laughs> I love you. people with different wheels. It's you so hard. It's so hard to get it right, isn't it? It is, it is, definitely. Could we uh, change the colour this year? Yeah. On them, they were brush gold. Yeah. Um, so, but they were all sort of blistering. All oh, right. So you just had it so, completely redone, yeah? Yeah. So, um, said it took a to get refurb. 
I, I said to him, choose whatever colour. I said long. I said I said sort of colour. I said, but if you do get the sun on, then they got that little bit of sparkle yeah. into them. Um, and he chose right then, yeah. Yeah, it was a gamble. Anyway, nice talking to you. You, you two have a good day. Right, Bye. Thank you. Cool little setup on the back of that. I love this little Mark one, and look, an R32 lump squeezed in there. It's just nearly perfect, isn't it? Little set of rotiform wheels on it, fully caged out in the back. Another one, look. It's looking standard, this one, but look how good they were when they first came out of the factory and just terrorised the streets. 1982 Mark 1 Golf. It's only got 70,000 miles on the clock. Fucking lovely. You alright, mate? These yours, yeah? This one, yeah, yeah. Is this your one as well, yeah? No. Is it? no. What's that? What air ride you got on that? Uh, air lift. Air lift, yeah? Yeah, yeah. That's sitting nice when it's down, isn't it? What's it ride like? It's not too bad, actually. It's right, to yeah. be right. fair, yeah, it yeah. rides alright, yeah. Standard engine or different supercharger? Or? No, it's just a stage 4 supercharger. Yeah. Nice. And did you get it all painted? Lockdown. Yeah. Yeah, paint colour made it, retrieve It's beautiful, mate, really is nice. Another cool little mark one, look at this. These cars are just so cool, I'm gonna have to walk back in a minute and get some pictures done. There goes the jet car. What's he run? 6.6 at 158. I saw this parked up earlier. This is really nice. A really cool dumb van with the air and the rotty forms, and it's all kitted out in the back for his dogs. Got four cages in the back for his dogs. I like the golf livery on this little caddy, little Mark 1 sitting here. So you're not just a show queen, I see him go down the track. I think he run a... I think it was a 13 flat at about 108, I can't quite remember. I've got it on video somewhere. Hello mate, how you doing? A nice little jet that's sitting here. That's cool as well, look at that man. I like the cream engine bay on it. On the old BBS alloys. This ain't different, isn't it? So I'll take it, he's put a set of arches on, widened it out a little bit. Give it that racing stance. And an 034 Motorsport intake on it. Is that a sequential box? So I imagine it is a proper track car then. Yeah, look at the fuel cell in the back. That is nice, isn't it? Look at the cage in that. That is nice. See, there's a lot more cars than when we first come in this morning. Super clean beetle over here. It's a 1954 beetle. Look at the condition of it. That's the end of the show and shine cars. 
Um, I'm going to go back down there later on and take some pictures. But we're going to walk up to the pits. I want to have a look at the Caddy RS3, have a look around that. They're not back on the track for 45 minutes. My favourite security guard's over here. He's just, he's just one of these nasty people. You don't, you know, you don't want to mess around with him because he takes his job very seriously. Isn't that right? Yeah, we've got this set up here. <laughs> I don't think I'd want to sleep up there. This must be the Lupo Club. Joe going down, I think it was a 9-0. Oh, has he borrowed that car or is he the owner? Yeah, one had a loose subframe, the wheel was going forward and backwards. Oh dear. Do you remember when I was on telly, Jim? Yeah, I do, yeah. <laughs> what telly was on? Babe Station, wasn't it? Uh, yeah. Babe Station, what are you on about? Celebrity Fat Club. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah. The correct word in that one was celebrity day. Yeah, yeah. That's Thank right. you. I hope you're not filming. No, no. I just walk around with this. <laughs> it, get, it gets me in places. Yeah. Doesn't it just? <laughs> Don't work. <laughs> High vis on the camera gets you in anywhere. <laughs> this is Blaine, everybody. Blaine is currently third place because he cheats. Look, he starts ahead of you. I'm not, I'm, I'm jesting Blaine, you need all the help you can get. Three, two, one, go! A little bit of a jump start, we don't mind, do we? We've got half the horsepower of the leader so far, but this is automatic. And the uh, gear change is here. Don't let me down, there we go. Doesn't crunch at all, does it? And forwards. And through the finish line, 38.7. He's getting slower and slower. Are you ready? Three, two, one, go. Oh, he's missed the set. He had to, didn't he? Missed a set of cones there. Go on, Stuart, into the finish line. And stop, well done, that was a 35-4, but you missed a set of cones. Oh. That would have been the leading time, but you missed a set of cones. Now, what's happened here then? <laughs> Is this a complete new car or the old one? Uh, it's the old one. But I'm going to paint it so that it's just, uh, everything just done was. Uh... So, what have you done? Is it just like fiberglass panels on it or yeah. lightened it? Is it lightened it down then, is it? It probably is a bit light because I've took a dash out, all wire loop, everything. So, what's it done? Just made it wider then to give it more? Yeah. So, I could put the wider rims back on. The other ones used to catch anyway, the wheels. So, so what did you do a minute ago? No, uh, nine. Nine eight. Nine eight hundred and forty one was not forty four. Hundred and forty four, yeah. So we're gonna be back in the eight soon then, yeah? <laughs> what time are you about half one, yeah? In a minute. Oh, have I got to walk all the way back again? Yeah. <laughs> well, anyway, I'll see you on the track, yeah? Right, so I've walked all the way up here. I've spoken as always for too long. And the guys are going back down. This day's about to start this one up. There he goes Wayne, he's run a ten to seven today. I think Dave's on a 9.4. What are you done today? 9.4 is it so far? 9.4. Yeah. Got more in it today? <laughs> nice one. And you're back on half one, aren't you? Yeah, I'll All right, I'll come down. So I've got to make it back down to the start, so I'll come back and talk to Richard in a minute. Oh, there you go. There's a car point. Oh, give me a lift. I jump in the back. Oh, the Mark III race car. The, the, my Mark III. Oh, the yeah, just had a little lift back from the far end of the uh, 
the pits down to the start line because we've got round the first round of the VW DRC heads up now I think we've I'm not sure how many cars are left in it but we'll get round to the start line and it's uh, eliminations now the semi-finals done of the heads up racing so in the final you've got Dave Henderson in his RS3 and Paul Jordan in his polo um, Richard went out in his caddy but he did manage to get a 9-9 I think so I think Richard's gonna come back around and put some street tires on it in a minute and he's gonna go for the fully street trim record which I think Stephen uh, has that record in his uh, Golf R powered caddy and I think he got down to an 11-1 in that it was the official record so hopefully we see him back around to try and get that record as well Yeah. 
to take the world record for the fastest VW Caddy in the world. Fifty-nine miles an hour. Jordy begins to slow at the top end with a 1023 at 142 miles an hour. But the win goes to Dave Henderson, MLC Tuning. Right, guys, that's it. That's the day done. Most of the uh, racing's finished now. We've had the final for the uh, the heads up. Have you just seen? And Dave Henderson and his uh, RS3 won that. So that's the first round to him. We're going to make a move now, get home, go through all this footage and see if we can make a video of it. And obviously we'll do some individual runs of some of the cars we've seen. But as always guys, thanks for watching and uh, catch up with me at another track event soon. Or you never know, I might be back out on the street. God bless. <laughs>